week has come to an end, meaning we're one week closer to election day on the 29th of May. The Independent Electoral Commission has urged political parties to approach the polls in peace and tranquility by adhering to the Electoral Code of Conduct. A ceremony was held for parties to sign that uh, code yesterday. We're now joined by IEC Commissioner Judge Dyer Pile. Commissioner, thank you. We appreciate it. I don't know if we've ever had peace and tranquility in South Africa, um, certainly not in the news, but we do have free and fair elections. And I guess it's worth remembering that as the whole world moves into this period of electoral uncertainty. Well, thank you very much for having me and giving me the opportunity to talk about the, the Code of Good Conduct um, that the IEC um, uh, got uh, assembled uh, political parties uh, yesterday to um, to make their pledges to the public. Um, they promised to uh, help the IEC to run the elections so that they come out uh, free and fair and inclusive. They also undertook to respect <clears throat> the outcome and also to respect the IEC and its practices and its rules. So um, that was um, uh, one of the highlights of our election timetable. And it's also a big highlight coming 30 years after democracy, that we are still holding elections, that they are peaceful, that they have been, that the results have been accepted. And generally, whenever parties have had uh, uh, disagreement with the outcome or any practice that the IAC has uh